The developments surrounding Naga peace talks continue to keep Manipur on the edge. And after a massive rally in Imphal today, representatives of the Coordination Committee for Manipur Integrity, which includes the UCM among others and leaders of various ethnic groups, summited what they termed as the last memorandum to Manipur Governor Najma Heptullah, stressing that the territorial integrity of the state should not be compromised with. Addressing media persons after submitting the memorandum, UCM leader K. Athoba informed that the Manipur governor had met her counterpart Arun Ravi in Delhi this week and aired Manipur's concern. A delegation of nine members from Kokomi with representatives from various ethnic communities have met the Honourable Governor of Manipur. We have submitted our one last memorandum to her, urge her for one last time. The integrity of the Manipur should not be compromised at any cost. She also expressed her support for the idea of Manipur, for the inclusiveness of Manipur. She also told us that definitely she will forward this memorandum to the Honourable Prime Minister and Home Minister. And as per her uh, opinion, two days back, uh, she met uh, the interlocutor of the peace talk, Mr. Arun Rabi, at New Delhi. And in that meeting also, she has she expressed her you know, concern for the uh, people of Manipur and asked the interlocutor to take a very good care of the uh, integrity of Manipur. And earlier during a rally in Imphal, the UCM leader set a deadline for the centre to communicate the developments surrounding the Naga peace talks. Athoba said the people of the state expected the picture to be clear by October 31st, failing which they will take a call on the future course of action. Now, as per, as per the assurances given by the Prime Minister of India on 2017, 28th December, now the people is expecting some words from him and as he said that, the prior consent or prior consultation will be taken up from the, for the, from the people of Manipur before coming to any uh, final settlement regarding this peace talks. Till that, they haven't met any communication or any kind of you know, words from the government of India side and the Prime Minister himself as well. Therefore, the countdown has really begun and we are setting a time frame that is the 31st of October. Before that, if the government of India fails to communicate with the people of Manipur before coming to any final conclusion, then the consequences is not going to be very good. and. Uh, if anything untoward happens, if anything that comes out as per, you know, against the, against the interests of the people of Manipur, then the people of Manipur will decide what to be done against the government of India and we will take our own course. And the protesters also submitted a memorandum to Manipur Chief Minister Enbirin Singh, who assured that the territorial integrity of the state will not be compromised with.